Hi, good afternoon, Houston. Luis Medina here, your Texas realtor. Uh, just wanted to reach out to you guys because I had actually received a call from one of my friends and they told me, he was like, hey, uh, we put this property up for sale. Um, just wanna let you know, it's like, oh, thank you for thinking about me. Uh, what's the address? So I looked it up and I said, hey, this is like a beautiful house, but um, you really need to get your agent, your realtor to get better pictures. They need to hire a photographer or whatever they have to do to get better pictures. And this is where most realtors fail to represent their client's best interest. Uh, for some reason or another, uh, they go out and they take their own pictures instead of hiring a photographer. Um, even, even I can take better pictures than some of the pictures that they're going. So if the if your realtor is not taking good pictures, they need to hire a realtor uh, because is those pictures generate interest the better the pictures are the more people are going to be looking at the property the the the, the higher chance that you can get an offer quicker and uh more people looking at the house more interest in it will generate generate a higher offer uh the more time your property is on the market the lower those that that offer is going to be uh so just make sure your client takes uh, better pictures i mean your realtor takes better pictures i had another client setting a house over here off of 1960 and he had hired another realtor uh because um uh he just couldn't find my information i don't know why he just said i couldn't find your information so i just hired somebody else it's like all right cool that's fine you know um and i said hey what's the address let me look at it and uh i was looking at it and i said hey you know you really need to get your realtor to take better pictures he says what do you mean they look beautiful i said okay let's look at this picture here what are you selling are you selling furniture because the picture was just of the couch you know pretty much and you know the couch i said you need the the realtor needs to get a wide angle lens camera wide angle lens takes uh, the full picture of the room so you can see the space you can see the entire room not just the furniture and when we started looking at other pictures they were all the same i said so are you uh, is this a furniture store or are you selling your house? And so he's, his, you know, he just realized, he's like, oh, wow, this is horrible. All the pictures were, I said, I mean, you can see a little bit of the house. You've done a great job. He invited me to go look at it. Uh, but uh, I didn't want to interfere with the relationship he had with the other realtor. But, you know, I still want to look at it just to see, you know, if I have a client that's interested in that house. Unfortunately, he was way overpriced. Uh, but either way, it, uh, when you're looking to uh, uh, hire a realtor to help you sell the property, you're normally going to get three types of realtors. You're going to get a realtor that's going to say, hey, I can sell this property. You're probably going to get this and you're going to feel that value is too low. You're going to get another realtor that's going to say, hey, here's what you know, you'll probably sell for. Um, and you may think, you know what, that's just not enough. And then you'll get another realtor that'll say, hey, I promise you, I can guarantee you that I can sell for this much, you know, get, and uh, they tell you value. Well, you can't really guarantee anything in real estate because like the stock market, we can't predict what the market is going to do. Uh, what I can tell you when someone's hiring me is that um, I will sell at top price. Uh, I'm not going to tell you what the top price is. I, I'll give you, I'll, once you sign with me and once you hire me, I will show you what that is. Uh, but most realtors will just tell you what the price is and what this is and that. That's really of no use. Any realtor that's been in the business for one week has access to that. They won't tell you what they're going to do to sell your house. And this is where, what, I, what I do differently. I tell you what I'm going to do. And one of the things that I do is I hire a professional and I take great pictures of your property so it could show well. On the MLS, you're currently allowed to take up to 50 pictures. I see a lot of houses with uh, 10 pictures, 12 pictures, 20 pictures. You need to showcase the house, you need to showcase that area. So that's why they let you put up to 50 pictures. Also, there's never a good reason, there's never a good reason to take cell phone pictures of your property. You need professional uh, pictures, you know, really good pictures with wide angle lens camera, professional equipment. So if you're thinking about selling, don't settle for anything less. Give me a call, 713-884-0502. I will get you top dollar and I will uh, prove my worth. 713-884-0502. Thank you.